let's look at adding and subtracting fractions. Before I can add or subtract two fractions, I need them to have the same denominator. Why is that? Well, if you look here where I'm trying to add two fifths and one third, what I have is two fifths are these two smaller yellow pieces here, and one third is this bigger red piece. So if I try and add them, I could say that I've got three pieces, but that doesn't really tell me how much that is, because is it three small pieces or is it three big pieces? Well, actually, it's a combination of the two, and so it doesn't really tell me how much I have. So I need to rewrite two fifths and one third, so they both have the same denominator, so I'm talking about the same size pieces that I can add. How do I find that common denominator? Well, I start by looking at five, the one denominator, and writing out all its multiples. Well, not all its multiples, a few of its multiples. Five, 10, 15, 20, etc. And then I go to the other denominator, and I write down some of its multiples. And I stop as soon as I get something that is the same in both those lists. And that will be my common denominator. I then go and rewrite two fifths as an equivalent fraction with that common denominator of 15. How do I get from 5 to 15? I multiplied by 3. If I do that to the denominator, I must do the same to the numerator. So 2 fifths is equal to 6 fifteenths. And then I go ahead and I do the same thing with 1 third. I need to get that to have a denominator of 15. Well, to get to 15, I multiplied by 5. So I must do the same to the numerator and I get 5 fifteenths. Now I'm ready to do my addition, because what I wanted to add was two fifths and one third. I couldn't do that because the denominators were different. But I now know that I can just write two fifths as six fifteenths. And I also know that one third is exactly the same as five fifteenths. And now everything has the same denominator. I'm talking about the same size pieces. So I've got six of the pieces and another five pieces. And so I've got 11 of those little 15th size pieces. And that's how I do it. And it'll be exactly the same procedure if I want to do a subtraction.